Hello, welcome back to my channel. This week's video is going to be more of a tutorial. I have Pocky's company. She has her Jurex bed here. And she's ready to look at us and sleep while we do what we're going to do. And for the next couple of weeks or so, uh, I'll be having tests and exams. Right, Pocky? And therefore, I'll be more stressed than usual and not having a lot of time for myself. One of the things that I really like too is to paint my nails and I like to do little drawings or stamps or sparkles or whatever. I like to have my nails painted. I use actual polish. My nails are natural and they grow a lot and they're, they're resistant so I don't really need to use any other type of method to have my nails big, long and pretty, the only thing I need is a nail polish. One thing that happens to me a lot during this time is I don't really want to spend the time doing the drawings because they take a long time, but I still want to do something nice. So one of the best methods is to use this, stamps. I have four different types. I order them all online, you don't really have to buy them a specific place. I ordered mine I think from Wish. I have three small ones and two big ones. Uh, one of the small ones is just flowers and some butterflies. The other one are flowers in like a half moon shape or a D shape. Then we have this one with fairies and uh, dandelions and some butterflies as well. Then this big one is just flowers and leaves. But I like the, the different types of flowers they have in it. This one is filled with patterns. It's different from the other ones, that's why I ordered it. All the other ones are basically flowers. Let's move to what we'll need. We really do need a scraper and then a stamper. I advise you to get one of these see-through ones because they're easier to place. Because you can see the nail as you can see here and it's easily easier to place and that's it, you don't need much to do this. I have different colors of polish because I want to show you different ways to do it. But you can only use one color or two and it's up to you. So let's get started. So, Bucky's ready. We are going to begin with a base coat. Make sure our nails are protected. Once it's dry, let's move and paint the undercoat. In this hand, I'm gonna use white and all my fingers, and in the other one, we'll do colors. There, all white. Okay, you wanna go run? Yeah, you wanna go? She wants to go. Let's set the piggy free. Okay, we're gonna have to wait for the nail polish to dry completely, otherwise we won't be able to stamp it correctly. I'm going to do the fairy here on this nail, like so. What we're gonna need is the black polish. We're gonna put some on top of the image, like so. And then we're gonna scrape it to get the get most of it off then steam you have a little bit of the excess in, of polish that you don't want you can use some you don't want to take too long doing this because you don't want the polish to dry too much otherwise we won't be able to do it then we get our nail really pretty and we press it and there we go we have a perfect drawing in our nail between uses. We do have to clean it up. Now, I'm going to show you other methods. Let's imagine I wanted this flower here. I don't want just the outline on the flower, I want it painted with some polish. And stamp. What we do is we take a little bit of polish and we paint it. We take our stamper and we stamp it and there we go. 
See, this is why you should let it dry completely. We have a red flower. Why not put some green leaves? This one's here. They look nice. Let me just take off what I don't want. Like this. I just want this. So now, look for the play and then put it in. Put it. And there we go. Beautiful drawing using stamps. What we can also do is with our stamp, put little dots of color and then in one nail you just smooth it all together. It creates a marble like look and then on top we can put a pattern. There we go, another beautiful looking nail. We can also, for example, let's use this ones. I have our design here. For example, let's get some rose gold, put it on top here. For example, silver. And there we go. I don't like this part being so empty. And there we go. Now, let's imagine you're going for a black and gold type of look. And there we go. We can do colors, we can do black and white, you can do whatever you like and you get different results, whatever your mood is. It is that simple. You don't need to worry. You don't need to spend hours doing drawings like this or something when you can do it just like that. And you can go from a boring hand, because you don't have time, to a hand filled with different drawings. Now I'm gonna go off camera and do some different combinations for this one and I'll show you the result. And there we go. We have this one where I used like, I did a rose with a black background with some gold and uh, silver. In this one I put the silver on the bottom and then I did a gold with a little split to the side so it would give you this effect. On the leaves I did the opposite. Then we have this one have a white background with some colors painted on the, the leaves and the flowers giving it this cool effect this one just a simple undercoat red and then I did a decorate between gold and silver to keep this look then you have a simple one where I did just the black stamping I put some flowers on the bottom and then three butterflies like final wave and this last one Super simple, it's one of my favorites, I paint a nail and I just do a little stem, like so, and I put some color, like white, in this example or any other color, and it looks super simple, like this, and that's it. 10 different looking nails, super easy and fast to do, using nothing else but a stamper and some stamps. And that's it for today's video, super easy, super fast, super simple, 10 different looking nails, you can do it with whatever colors you want, whatever pattern you want, all different ones, the same type in, a, in each nail. It doesn't matter. You won't just be a simple nail polish. You can have a million different ways of doing this. This thing, it's not expensive. You can order them online, like in Wish, Amazon, uh, AliExpress, wherever. You don't have to pay a lot to have them. And they're super fun to use, honestly. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next week. Bye bye. I have nails. I have different nails.